I'm gonna ask you five uh, business tips. So start keeping that in mind and uh, let's we'll see what they are. Okay, so business tip number one before you begin, you gotta have a game plan, a strategy of how you're gonna succeed. Don't just jump into a business blindly. Have your map set out in front of you and execute that plan. Okay, so now you've been motivated to become your own boss, and then you also got your game plan to start your own business. So what's next? Now, once you have your whole game plan set up of how you're going to start your business and how you're going to succeed, it's very easy to get deterred after you have your whole plan ahead of you. So do not get deterred. No, be confident in your plan. You made the plan for a reason, so you know it's going to work. So don't have outside people trying to tell you you can't do it. Don't have these self-doubts coming up saying that you can't do it, because you can, because you already have the game plan. Okay, so now we are at tip number three. You have your game plan. You're not going to let anybody discourage you from that game plan. And now you got to stick with it. You, you know it's going to work. Let the play develop. Don't abandon play before it's fully developed. Sometimes it might take a little longer than expected, so stick with it and you know it will work. Okay, so now for tip number three. You have your business going, and you also are not going to be deterred. Next, find a good mentor in your field that you can get tips from and just, you know, get advice from, because that will help you in the long run. Preach. Okay, so now we get to tip four. Start building your team. It's too much work to do by yourself. You gotta get people that are as good as you, if not better, as part of your team. Yeah, I definitely agree. And I'm glad that you moved to one of my teams. You definitely don't. Okay, so now we're on tip number five. Once you see your business start to grow, next thing you want to do is aggressively expand. Get it as big as possible, as fast as possible. That way, if you want to eventually exit that business, you can sell it for a high profit. Hi uh, guys, so after you guys aggressively grew your business and you got in, uh, you grew your business, you made your money, and you think of an exit strategy. The worst thing you could do is sink all your profits back into your business uh, and have it you know, grow, 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 and then one day it dissipates. So think of an exit strategy. Uh, the best way to do it is to automate it, and that way it makes it really easy to sell. Uh, get in, make your money, and get out. <laughs> okay, so tip number six. Get all negative people from your life. All they will do is drain you of your energy, your ideas, and your creativity. So get rid of negative people immediately. Okay, tip number seven. Live freely. Don't be confined by what society's norms expect of you. Travel. Pursue your dream, pursue your goals, and go after your business. Live free like a bird. Hi! Jesus. Okay, next tip. Once you start your business, I want you to devour the competition. Be like a tiger. Go after the prey, wipe out the competition. Be the best in your field. Okay, so now time for the final tip. You have your business up and running. You're seeing some success. You're making some profit. Now I want you to stop thinking off the rack and start thinking custom. Start dressing like a boss. Then you're on your way to your success. Uh -huh. So we started independent, but now we on the majors, yeah.